I request the senior applicants to please come and sit in the front seats. discuss today the new judgment which is causing a great deal of upheaval in the state of Kerala at present. The speech will obviously not be political, although it has political uh, aspects to it. The judgment has political aspects to it, which we are all aware of. The speech will be an analysis of the law and therefore essentially a speech meant for lawyers, which is what most of us here are, barring one or two who uh, are here because of their love and affection for me. But barring that, I will uh, certainly hope to bring about a greater clarity in your minds about what the problem in the Sabri Mala judgment is. Around 28th of September, the Supreme Court of India delivered its landmark judgment in the Sabri Mala case. The petition was under Article 32. All of you know what that means. It means the proceedings arose for the first time in the Supreme Court itself. It was not an appeal from the High Court, that was under Article 132. It was a petition under Article 32. Usually a petition under Article 32 concerns the violation of a fundamental right. That should be the basis of an Article 32 petition. So it was a petition under Article 32 seeking directions against the Kerala government and the Sabrimala Temple Board to ensure entry of female devotees between the ages of 10 and 50 into the Lord Ayappa Temple, which had been denied to them based on custom and usage. Incidentally, that was not the only basis of denial. The denial was also as a result of certain laws that operated in Kerala. In particular, the Kerala Hindu Places of Worship Authorization of Entry Act, as I act I think, that, and rules that were framed under that act. Challenge by Ota, the challenge was under Article 14, 14 and the equality, equality before law, equal protection of law. It was under Article 15. 15 will be discrimination between sexes or discrimination based on religion, you can't have that. So that was the second challenge that was there. The challenge under Article 25, 25 is your fundamental right to belief, fundamental right to practice and propagate a particular religious belief. That was an Article 25 challenge. And finally, it was also a challenge under Article 51 AE, which is uh, the fundamental duties, chapter Kali, uh, with reference to a certain kind of egalitarian temperament that the nation should develop. Here, Vyakta challenges hote. 
एक अव्यक्त चैलेंज होता विच वॉज आर्टिकल ट्वेंटी सिक्स आर्टिकल ट्वेंटी सिक्स इन आर्टिकल ट्वेंटी फाइव आर रिलेटेड आर्टिकल ट्वेंटी फाइव रिलेट्स टू द राइट टू बिलीव द राइट टू अ पर्टिकुलर रिलीजन आर्टिकल ट्वेंटी सिक्स इज कनेक्टेड विद द राइट टू मैनेज द अफेयर्स ऑफ अ रिलीजन शिक्षण राइट शैक्षणिक संस्था चालवने राइट हम जो फरक है सर्वसाधारणपे तो फरक आर्टिकल ट्वेंटी फाइव आर्टिकल ट्वेंटी सिक्स मध्य है सिग्निफिकन्स ऑफ आर्टिकल ट्वेंटी सिक्स इज ट्वेंटी फाइव नुस्त आइसोलेशन मध्य जर तुम्हें वाचल तो ट्वेंटी फाइव बिकम्स अ काइंड ऑफ ए वॉट शेल आई से अमोर्फस राइट बॉडी देनेकरता अंगीकृत करनेकरता एक कैरेक्टर देनेकरता सविश्वास लगता इट्स ट्वेंटी सिक्स एंड ट्वेंटी फाइव रेड टूगेदर दैट कॉन्स्टिट्यूट वॉट वी अंडरस्टैंड एज अ राइट टू रिलीजन अ राइट टू मैनेज द रिलीजन एंड अ राइट टू रिलीजन आर रियली टू बी अंडरस्टूड टूगेदर आज का होता है जो विचार करा अ जजमेंट ऑन ट्वेंटी फाइव अलविंग वीमेन टू एंटर is causing a problem on the management of the temple so 25 and 26 should not be seen divorced they should be seen together i am just telling you this because this is a situation that occurs whenever we talk of religious rights those who want to preserve certain traditions such as women's entry we we'll always say ki amcha 26 ta right hai to manage bolu na mi bayka nahi hu dena nahi your own court saw the shani temple matter i had argued the uh, the the haji ali case darga matter in the bombay high court all the the, the matter that i argued in the supreme court of that matter the high court the beef bat all these are rights which are available as fundamental rights and at the same time are managed in terms of religious rights so it's a correlation of both things that happen let me proceed further the central constitutional provision provides the context for considering the problem I have just told you what these articles are. Oh, incidentally, a copy of my speech is available at the Bar Association. So those of you who want to go home now and want to read it at leisure are welcome to do so. I will not take umbrage if you leave the hall. I will be more than happy to catch an earlier flight home. But uh, to come back, to this, it's available. It's also available with the Bar Association on. email so if you want it on your internet you can make a request and so the bar association will provide you with a copy of the speech uh, fundamental right to religion under article 25 is a very peculiar right because it says that it is subject to the other rights given in This part of the Constitution, this part of the Book Law, Part Three, the Chapter on Fundamental Rights. Therefore, the right to religion does not exist independent of, uncontrolled by, unbridled of other rights that are contained in Article Thirteen till Thirteen. त्या पूर्ण बाकी आर्टिकल्स का इम्पैक्ट घेन आर्टिकल पंचवीस समझाव लगता हा खूब इम्पॉर्टंट मुद्दा है कारण मोस्ट पीपल थिंक की धर्म इज दी एंड ऑफ एवरीथिंग आम की धार्मिक भावना एक्सेट्रा 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 नो इट कांट बी दैट इट हैज टू बी अंडरस्टूड इन द कॉन्टेक्स्ट ऑफ अदर पीपल्स राइट देर फॉर वेन द मुस्लिम सेड दैट यू कांट अलाउ वीमेन इन टू द दर्डा इफ यू अलाउ दे यू कांट अलाउ दे टू टच द मजर men alone will touch the mother of the saint and the women must stand at another side 
you are looking at the right only through the window of 25 पण ज्या खोलीत तुम्ही उभे आहात त्या खोलीला अनेक खिडक्या आहेत आणि बाकीच्या खिडक्या उघडून बघा हे कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन म्हणत यू कॅन्ट अंडरस्टँड द राईट टू रिलिजन ओनली इन टर्म्स ऑफ द रिलिजन तसं केलं तर मग तुमच्या सगळ्या खाप पंचायती येतात तुमचे खाऊ विजलांटीज येतात तुमचे मॉरल पोलीस येतात प्रत्येक जण तो राईट आपल्या धार्मिक भावनेतून बघतो आणि पलीकडल्या कॉन्स्टिट्यूशनला गोबाय देतो This is impermissible, says the article itself. 25 tells us that you must look at that, uh, that right in the context of all other rights. So just bear that in mind. Reminds me of an interesting story. Uh, the right to religion. I uh, gave you the example of the Haji Ali Darga where the argument was that women can't be allowed to come in. बिकॉज विमेन आर ट्रबल्ड बाय मेन आणि पुन्हा बायका त्या मजरला हात लावल्यात तर द मजर विल मेक अ बिंग प्युअर नॉट व्हेरी डिफरंट फ्रॉम द सबरी मला काइंड ऑफ थिंकिंग अँड बॉम्बे हायकोर्ट सेड नो वी विल अलाउ विमेन द सेम राईट दॅट इज अलाउड टू मेन सो दे वेंट ऑन द प्रिन्सिपल ऑफ इक्वालिटी they went on the principle of non discrimination on the ground of sex where are those articles coming from equality is 40 discrimination on ground of sex is 15 25 is religion but they refused to look at it as a 25 matter they looked at it in form of the other things in one of my travels i happened to be in turkey once And in Turkey, there is a beautiful mosque. It is called the Hagia Sophia Mosque. One of the finest mosques there is in the world. A spectacular six minaret to mosque. And when we were being shown in the mosque, tourists are allowed to go in at certain times. So we had gone in, we were looking. And the guide was telling us, ki, this is where women, because it's a chika chik padde hoti, techa maage, women sit that side and pray. Men will pray over here. तेव्हा माझ्या मधला विलन जागा झाला आणि आय आज द टुरिस्ट गाईड की वाय आर विमेन मेड टू सिट सेपरेट वाय कॅन दे सिट ओव्हर हिअर अँड प्रे इज इट नो दिस इज अ ट्रेडिशन इन मुस्लिम चर्च मोस्ट विमेन विल ऑलवेज प्रे सेपरेट वेन विल प्रे सेपरेट एक्सेप्ट इन वन प्लेस आय सेट विच इज दॅट इज इट इफ यू गो टू मेक्का तिथला जो काबा आहे तिथे मेन अँड विमेन विल प्रे टुगेदर अति विद्वान असल्यामुळे स्वतःची विद्वत्ता दाखवली त्याला का हो तिथे का म्हणून दे प्रे टुगेदर यू गेव मी अ वंडरफुल आन्सर इज अ सर इफ आफ्टर यू गो टू मेका यू स्टील वॉन्ट टू लुक एट विमेन देन इवन अल्ला कॅन हेल्प यू म्हणून सेग्रिगेशन इज अ मॅटर ऑफ मॅनेजमेंट ऑफ रिलिजन इट हॅज नथिंग टू डू विथ रिलिजन इट सेल्फ बायकांना वेगळं ठेवणं हे आम्ही मॅनेजमेंट करता करतो मी समजू शकतो सो यू गिव अ डिफरंट टाइम वेन विमेन कॅन एंटर यू गिव अ डिफरंट रोड बाय विच दे कॅन बी टेकन इन अँड टेकन आउट दे कॅन बी रिझन फॉर दॅट बट टू से विमेन कॅन डू दिस इज डिफरंट दॅट्स वॉट इज प्रोहिबिटेड सो आर्टिकल ट्वेंटी फाईव्ह वेन वी कन्सिडर द कॉन्टेक्स्ट ऑफ ट्वेंटी फाईव्ह प्लीज अंडरस्टँड दॅट इट इज नॉट द बी ऑल अँड एंड ऑल ऑफ रिलिजियस राईट्स इन इंडिया our religious rights come from several sources once that is understood the rest of it becomes relatively easy what happened in sabri mala is something i can't come to unless i first explain to you the law that preceded it now this is uh, as lawyers you understand you know the eight judgment you know what's the guys arthan also unless of course the judgment is the first of its kind a judgment is a judgment in a line of precedence te tumhala te nadi cha ugama sarkha mage 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 ja uthun suru hota hai paav lagta where does the discussion on religious rights begin it starts with a case that is called the shirur math case shirur that's a citation over there in the paper made i you find it over there all the judgments that i am discussing have been 
laid out with references in the paper, you'll get it. Shirur Mahti case, he ahe Ekunisha Chopal Sachi. 1954, four years after the constitution was born, came about the first case of Shirur Mahti. This was a seven judge bench and it contained uh, one of my favorite judges, Justice Vivian Bose, who went to the Supreme Court from Nagpur. So we have, I have a special regard for him because he was one of the finest judges that we have ever seen. Justice Vivian Bose uh, was a very modest and assuming man. He was knighted, so he was called Sir Vivian. Sir Ki Vivyoti Dena. Justice Vivian Bose would, the stories about him are legendary. He would drive to London in the vacations. At that time, Pakistan wasn't a problem one could drive across Europe. So he used to drive. In, his wife was English. So he would drive there in summer vacations. Uh, he was a great lawyer. Uh, Justice Vivian Bose, I'm surprised, gave uh, 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 the judgment wasn't written by him, but he was a party to this seven judge constitution bench, which unanimously said something that laid the wrong foundation in religion, in the law concerning religion. This in this case, Shirur Mat, the Mathadish, the, the head of the Mat, challenged a law that related to the Madras Hindu Religious Endowment Act. Certain provisions of the act were challenged as being against the right to religion. And that challenge was the Supreme Court Kayamanar. Article 25 protects not only religion, but also acts done pursuant to religion. An act done pursuant to religion and a religious act are both protected by 25 is what they said. <coughs> what is a religious act? But everything can be an act done pursuant to religion. देवड़ा by saying it will include acts done pursuant to religion. And about which I will be talking is as a result of this view of the Supreme Court that religion includes acts done pursuant to religion. The expression practice of religion, according to Supreme Court, they were taking the analogy from Australian law. Australian law was a similar provision. Hai. And uh, Latham J. Australian High Court's uh, judgment, Yaha Shabdat Mantlena. Act done in pursuance of religion is also a part of religious belief. Religious belief includes acts done in pursuance of religion. The Supreme Court explained what constitutes the essential part of religion is primarily to be ascertained with reference to the doctrine of the religion itself. But under Article 26b, I told you 25 and 26, 26b, a religious denomination or an organization enjoys for complete autonomy in the matter of deciding as to what rites and ceremonies are essential according to the tenets of the religion, they and no outside authority has jurisdiction to interfere with the matter. Supreme Court Ali Mantla, the religions are the radhika rahets, but some is khali to manage religions are so bad. The managing of religion, the authority, the religious authority, 
has a right to decide what is integral to their religion. The danger is dharma. All of you who know a smattering of Sanskrit will immediately understand dharma ka artha religion hot nahi. Dharma ka artha kaida hoto. Dharma ka literal translation into Marathi will be law, will be kaida. Dharma and what is integral to it, he decide karatastana, tya dharma kya doctrine cha palikane zaun, essential and inessential kaya he, he tya dharma che loka santil te ase. Asa mantra. This is what we have been fighting for the last 50 years. Dharma che loka santil mantra ko on, when the Hindu Asanta Brahman Sakelte, Musulman Asanta Maulani Sakelte, Parsi Asanta Azun Kodi Sakelte, Christian Asanta Azun Kodi, Thorka Mari to Dharma Rala Eki Kare, and in the Tower of Hashra Karna Rala to Sri Kare. Hindu Dharma Tsa Mool Pusta Kukla Yatsa Uttar Zara Pernam. Wait there are so. The Veda for a big Pasha Valley. Aranyaka. Brahmana are all interpretation of the Vedas. Bhagavad Gita itself is an interpretation. It's not an original text. It's not a basis of, you may call it the basis of Hindu. Ekhadya Mansani kiti hi vikwara to ase na ka. Tehacha bhasha madhe sa interpretation ke la. Tar te interpretation hai dharma hai ka nahi. Ya prashna cha uttar article 25 man to nahi. Adi article 26 man to kai. And at that time, in 1954, Supreme Court went to Dhoni Varubar Vacha. And therefore, it will become a part of your religion. Complications there, Manu Chaka. Lahan Kodi Ni Maja Ajila Vichar Lao Chani, Barpur Maakhal Lao Chaki, So, say, 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 Satya Narayana Chha Pooja Madhe, Kalavati Ki Pooja Sodun Dhavat Parat, Navrat Sodun Dhavat Parat, Alla Bodun Jate, that's a Kautuk, the Zaz, Puna Nukta, Bhakti, Puna Yun, Puja Kata, Deva, Puna Vari, yes, sir. Chhar Goshta. But that's how the Shira Kasa Kara Vahe Saki Chela. Itka Kup Gya, Itka Rava Gya, Itka Amuk Lakar Gya. The Sakhrit's invention is after the British came to India for one side. Mirchi Apli Nauti, Tumala Vishwas Vasil, Dine Mala Maithi Mudhi, we have facts on that. We got chilies only through the Portuguese. That's why the Mirchi Maik Tauti Apna Dejala Batata Upasana Chalto and Batata Bharata Chalai. Also, what I'm trying to explain to you is that Kalavati Cha Goshti Madhe He Kodi Tharvayana Ki Asa Shira Kare Lava. That's why we mark it. The point is to my Aji, this was blasphemy. That's why Dharma Cha Bhaje. Hey, Shiva Kasa Karayla Hava Hindu Dharma Ka Bhaage, Aza Dharma Kutta Ni Un Thayla Hai Tuhi. Minimum Swaipa Kache Level La Hai La Hai, Dati Lagek Swaipa Ki, there are five minds of people. But the fact we will be, this can't be religion. We have to be able to distinguish between what is the core of religion and what is the addition to religion. And that's exactly what the Supreme Court has done now. I'll tell you how it happens. So that was the first judgment, the Shiva Rumat. Shirurmat was followed by the Darga Ajmer Sahib judgment, again in which in the Rajasthan High Court, certain practices which were in, uh, sought to be controlled under the Darga Paja Sahib Act were challenged. And Tyacha Made, Pahila departure Surula. The Darga Paja Sahib, uh, Darga Ajmer judgment is 1961. Ekuri Sheikh Sash Sali, Supreme Court Ali, Paj Saha Varsha Purvi Dilela Kaida Pusun, Oda Parak Surukira. And what do they say? They want that protection must be confined to such religious practice as are essential and integral to the religion itself and no other. Ekhadya religion as a Ekhadi practice integral as a Thirty religion madhe dharavi, neither the woman. Shirurmat said, 
who clean religious practice, so long as the majority of the people practicing the religion say, ki hi aahe, tu wala ki maanye kara bhi laahe. This judgment says, no, it has to be an essential and integral part of that religion. No other practice can be taken. But tari practice la sthaan di la. Practice has to be taken, religion sa baat. But it has to be such as essential and integral. The he kon tharauna integral ka hai, essential ka hai. Matter came up in a, uh, the uh, in a Bombay judgment, Sardar Saidana Tahir Saifuddin versus Bombay, Jacha Made, Ori Muslims had the right to excommunicate. Manja Dharma Tun Kodala Vadi Takna, Kadun Takna. That right was debated. And while considering that, it also came up in the Natsdwara case. Aplya Deshati Kiti Moti Moti Devoda and Kiti Mota Mota Zausta, Achamutan Doke Pudi Karta, Achi Udarna, Gele Athoda Puril, the Rami Inklo, our Chief Justice, who went up for this court, gave a judgment in our favor. The Parsis in Bombay objected to the metro going under their uh, Akyari, saying that this will destroy their religion. I will not go into the details of that, the judgment is short, it's now in appeal in the Supreme Court. But the fact remains that they said, Tumchi Aggadi or Amcha Devra Khalun Geli, and Amcha Dharma something. And essential and integral. What is essential to your religion? The fire is essential. Ma, fire laka yota yaka nahi, fire laka yota Ma, the fire like kadiksha nahi. Utha, prutvi cha bhoogar baat. ॉरिटीजन <laughs> 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 But the fire connected nine yet invisible and like what should they have? But the same sewer lines get there, water lines get there, electric line was a peak at Kumara Petro. The fight, this was the fight. The point is, is it essential and integral? The practice is what the Supreme Court has been talking about in the excommunication case. Then, of course, comes the uh, the Maharaja Narendra Prasad Ji versus the Gujarat case, where the Supreme Court says that when you try to regulate a right that concerns religion, the substance of the freedom should not be affected. Tumala dharma cha right to practice and propagate. These are the words that have been used. Right to practice my religion right to propagate my religion has a disturbed both the sale to tumhala to right jab tumka right to practice disturb hota right to propagate disturb hota then you are violating the fundamental right to religion that is what was said in the gujarat judgment in the tirupati balaji case they said something more interesting in the tirupati balaji case which happens in 1996 they said the state has a right to interfere in public good. Janate cha bhalo hona rasel, tar tumhala religion madhe interfere, right to religion madhe interfere karay cha, adhikar rai. Kiti essentially important statement hai yata vichar kara. Bahujana hitaya, bahujana sukhaya apod manto, पब्लिक गुड जास्ती जास्त लोक भल्या करता जर का मेट्रो तुम्हारा अग्नि खालू गरजे चाहिए रिलीजियस राइट पब्लिक गुड है इंडिविजुअल्स राइट दैट इज वॉट दे से इन दी तिरुपति तिरुपति बालाजी का यस इन द तिरुपति बालाजी केस देन ऑफकोर्स it, this just shows you how the pendulum swings to the other end. 
came that remarkable case in 2004, which is called the, uh, uh, it has a technical now, eh? Commissioner of Police versus Acharya Jagdishwarananda. Jagdishwarananda Acharya was the head of the uh, Anand Margis. And the Anand Margis believed that they had a right to perform the Tandav on the road with a naked sword in one hand and skulls in another hand. Manje Khautya and Talwari Yun Rastevar and Tandav Karanjav ha amsa religious right hai. And police commissioner ni jama te natak thambo ula they went all the way to the Supreme Court fighting saying this is our religious right. Please remember this is not a private madness of ours. This is universal. Dharma Mantra Mandi, Ithun Dipparenta Sabrenshi Toki Kharabhata. I am giving you these examples so that you will understand. America Mandi, the Hare Krishna cult, won all the way to the Supreme Court of the United States, permitting them to beg at airports. Airport Mandi, Yenara Yenara Lokarna Thambhud, Hare Krishna Ji Pustaka Vika, Paisa Maga, Ha Amsa Dharmi Vara Hai, And He Ami Karna. Ape Padda Mansa Tu Vima, as a religious right. And if they believe in it, it can be practiced. And the Yachin repercussions, Kya Ovani Zo Lo America Dharman Zala, Yacha Vapur Karun, the Anand Margi said, we have a right to perform the time. And you have fundamental right to our religion. An integral and essential part of religion. As a Shankar Mahadev Bhagavan Ni, Kaya Tandav Kela Hota Hai Kona Las Mai. None of us have actually seen it being performed. But these people believe that what they are doing is the Tandav. And if that is what they believe, then it is a part of their right. And in order to do the Tandav, they have to have a naked sword in one hand and a skull in the other. Thereby essentially spreading terror, making people feel intimidated by this whole procession of sadhus who is doing this. And to say, this is a part of my religion and I must be allowed to practice it, the Supreme Court said, rubbish. You can't. This is not a part of any Hindu religion and it will not survive. Yacha Mude, a far important Ashit test Supreme Court till Leda And that is the test which prevails even today. What is the test the Supreme Court made up? The Supreme Court said that what is integral or essential and what is not, hey, decide karai karta. If you want to take away that practice, would the religion collapse and die? If that happens, it is integral. And if that doesn't happen, it's not integral. 99% of the problem solved Zalit and as a Kutli's practice wala imagine karta yet nahi. Ji thamba hulay mule, Hindu dharma sampla, ki wo musalman dharma sampla, ki wo krishna dharma sampla, ki wo parsi dharma sampla, sa apun mulu chapu. So essential religious practice, integral religious practice, yasa definition deta na, Supreme Court laid down this step, that what is essential and what is integral, in order to determine that, can that practice be removed? And if it is removed, will the religion be recognizable as a religion or will it fail, will it die, will it collapse? That will be the test. Based on that, the beef bag matter, these are all reported judgments, you might want to read them sometimes. That's where I argued that even under Islamic law, you don't have to slaughter a cow. Eid la ke a camel slaughter nahi karta ala tar teen cow slaughter kara. Teen cow slaughter karta ala nahi tar saath bakra slaughter kara. Saath bakra karta ala nahi tar azun ka slaughter kara. Stages madhe dila hai. Obviously it means that slaughtering of a cow is not the integral part. And therefore several high courts and the Supreme Court have held that slaughtering of a cow is not an integral part of Islam. The same thing. If you took this away will Islam die? If it doesn't die, then you can't say it is integral to Islam. 
These are tests that have now come to be established. But it took the year 2004 and a bunch of sadhus with swords to convince the Supreme Court that they must say this. Otherwise, Shirur Math Prasun, a deviation yaya, don ikuni shet shopan, te don azar char, nada gadi kwai tai kun patna swar shakili. Fifty years it took the Supreme Court to move to a position where they pointed out what is the test. Mean number of years ka sankar. Karan believe me, itki varsha loka chi doki khara motra. Pute tari apan kaida pahela spatkya neat mandla. तर त्याचं काय जे ऑपोजिशन आहे त्याचं काय जे उदाहरण घ्यायचं आहे ते येऊन संपत सध्या केरळचं उदाहरण आलेलं आहे ते दूध फसवसून एकदा खाली जाईल यज्ञेच्या होमात जाईल मग थंड होईल सगळं इट हॅज समथिंग टू डू विथ वन ऑफ माय पेट आर्ग्युमेंट्स की इन मॅटर्स ऑफ रिलिजन इन मॅटर्स ऑफ सोशल चेंज लो कॅनॉट प्रिसीड चेंज Change must proceed. Raja Ramohan Royal is a mantras to sati band karatar sati pap janmat band zaginas. Logan ji chauti kya ka sati band karayala when Raja Ramohan Royal became a spokesperson. That is why the change happened. Neither of the gattan ne khi le lai. Untouchability is abolished. Sagran na kuthe hi paani pehla hava. You will not have shed. There is no longer a dalit and no longer a प्रगत क्लास पण आहे ना अजून त्यामुळे नुसतं पुस्तकात लिहिलं की ते नाहीस होत नाही तुम्ही कायदा पास केला म्हणून समाज बदलतो हे खूप बाळगून समज आहे असं नसत समाज बदलतो आणि मग कायदा आला तर काहीतरी होत हा कायदा समटाईम्स हेल्प टू पुश द सोसायटी इन अ पर्टिक्युलर डायरेक्शन पण जो कायद्याला आणखी कायदा राबवणाऱ्या यंत्रणेला जो जोर लागतो तो जोर आणि समाज जिथे तयार असतो बदल करायला त्याच्यात लागणारा जो जमीन आसमानाचा फरक आहे जस्ट अंडरस्टँड दिस सोशल चेंज अकॉर्डिंग टू बी मस्ट रिसीव लॉ अदरवाइज युअर लॉ रिमेन्स ऑन बुक्स अँड इट विल नेव्हर बी इम्प्लिमेंटेड गोईंग फर्दर टू रिसेंट जजमेंट्स बोथ डिलिव्हर्ड बाय अवर हायकोर्ट वन इज कॉल्ड हरीश जगतियानी वर्सेस युनियन ऑफ इंडिया दिस वॉज द काउन्स लॉटर जजमेंट जस्टिस ओक एंड जस्टिस गुप्ते आणि दुसरं इज डॉक्टर नफीसा नूरजहान शैफा नाज विच इज दी हजी अली दर्गा जजमेंट इन विच दे हेड दॅट दीज वर नॉट इसेन्शियल रिलिजियस प्रॅक्टिसेस अँड हॅव इन सेड दॅट दे सेड दॅट काउन्स लॉटर बॅन इन महाराष्ट्र वॉज अप टू बी अप ऑफकोर्स देर वर सम प्रोव्हिजन्स इन द काउन्स लॉटर थ्रू बॅन ऍक्ट सच ॲज you could arrest somebody who was cooking beef on the ground that the beef he was cooking was cow at the maharashtra mazi there is no ban on buffalo meat in deshwar there is no ban on buffalo meat so you can eat buffalo which is not cow cow is protected buffalo is not protected at the me we feed her some the aslo and me maja butcher kade who is a licensed butcher selling in a licensed corporation shop बीफ तिथे बीफ विकत घेतलं त्या बुचरकानी स्लॉटर हाऊस मधून ऑफिशियली कॉर्पोरेशनचे ठप्पे मारलेलं बीफ आणलेलं असलं तर हे बीफ गाईच आहे का बुलकच आहे बफेलोच आहे हे आपण सांगू नाही शकत पण पोलीस कॅन स्टील अरेस्ट यू इन युअर हाऊस सेंग युअर कुकिंग ए बफेलो का मग तुम्ही दहा पोलिसांनी खेट आहे ऑपोजिंग मी इन दिस मॅटर वॉज एस पी टी नॉय वन ऑफ द फायनेस्ट काउन्सिल इन बॉम्बे हायकोर्ट सर्टी इन द सुप्रीम कोर्ट हु डिस्क्राईब मी ब्युटिफुली ही सर सिन्स वेन डज द लॉ हॅव द अथॉरिटी टू लिफ्ट द लीड ऑफ माय पॉट विच इज कुकिंग इन माय हाऊस अँड लुक इन साईड द पॉट अँड डिसाईड वॉट आय मीटिंग इज इट लिगल ऑर इन लिगल तुम्हाला काय कंट्रोल करायचं तर तुम्ही बाहेर करा Make sure that cow is not slaughtered. So, mala yon pakdun karta hai. Sir, or sort, police ana rampant adhikar de na loka na chhaina te dhande hai. At that point of time, I was, was the advocate general. And using the privilege of an advocate general, which incidentally advocate generals have, and 
which they are really not supposed to use. I made a submission to the court which is recorded that these provisions should be struck down as unconstitutional. They were struck down as unconstitutional. I don't see how the first law officer of the state, now Girasif, this doesn't apply to you. <laughs> you have to defend the law as it stands. But the advocate general has a right to tell the court that this law is bad. To that extent that the, the provisions were permitting people to be harassed, we said that this provision has to go. And the court struck down those provisions by which police action could be taken. But it did save the law. That, that is for analysis to think. But given the fact that somewhere in my upbringing there is a little bit of knowledge of Sanskrit, there is something called Ardham Tejati Pandita. To save the law by giving up the bad part, the rest of it is saved. I don't think I did it for that reason. I'm personally of the view that police can't really harass people. I go to a five-star hotel and I eat beef. You can't come and arrest me at my dining room table in the hotel saying, Mr. So-and-so, what you are eating is illegal. You now come to the police station. It can't be done. It shouldn't be done. So that part of the law was struck down. These are two judgments of our court. Both of them went to the Supreme Court and were appealed, but which should be read. They are very important judgments. Now, when the court considers this, it's considering 25 and 26. It is applying two tests. I gave you one test that a very one is the principle of harmonious construction. You have to construe all articles of the constitution harmoniously in order to give the proper effect. That's our fact law. I'm not going to go into it, but you could read it at leisure if you're interested in knowing how harmonious construction is used while interpreting constitution. The other principle which is more important and which is more interesting and which is recently being used and not argued very much at least in India now, is what is known as the doctrine of proportionality. A very interesting doctrine. Proportionality mante ki tumi ekhati goshti cha legal validity judge karta. Tema proportionality cha vichar kara. All of you who are familiar with constitutional law know that when we talk about uh, the court can not go into the merit of a decision, <clears throat> but can examine the decision-making process, the witness very principle uh, which we talk of. Tyachamade, Pakta process baga, decision bahu naka, yacha mirror opposite principle ata nirman galela hai, chala proportionality manta. Proportionality kai manta, ki decision examine ka, is the decision in proportion to the problem that you are dealing with ever. Ha manu sore, yani sori ke li, yala bhar chaukat zon phatke mara. I am not telling you imaginary stories, these things have happened. We have had judgments of Rajasthan High Court, where the, uh, sorry, uh, of, of the district court in Rajasthan, where they have said, ya chora zon public mode mara. You can't do that, that's not the rule of law. You send him to jail, you can't tell him to jail, you're not allowed to, allow to be flogged in public. No. But decision-making process is not the case. You can't do that, 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 you can't do you can't do you can't do that, you can't do that, you can't do that, you that, that high court judge in Ilabad, Jala sleeper coach with the birth delay, Mudun conductor, the contempt card. Proportionality is a vichar karaz. How does that man commit contempt? Some of the high court judge says, No, I followed full procedure. Proportionality needs to be addressed. You remember those beautiful, wonderful cases of <coughs> again Ilabad, Jite Ilabad high court issued a writ against the legislature. Yes. And the legislature issued a writ against the Ilhabad High Court. And he read up for the Supreme Court and said, Shanta Karawa Laglo. 
What is it? Proportionality. Procedures are both were right in their procedures. Proportionality. Can you allow this kind of thing to go out of hand? Proportionality is the new doctrine against which you will be judging. So even in matters of religion, proportionality becomes relevant. I now come to Sabrimala judgment. Give me about yeah, 10 minutes. Sahavastha. To me, mokra. Me, mokra. Uh, Sabrimala judgment. Now this happens in 2018. Sabrimala judgment is by four judges. Uh, nine, four, nine, five. Constitution judgment. Five judges. Dohagana, the Chief Justice and Justice Khanvilkar. Chief Justice every then was Deepak Mishra and Justice Khanvilkar write a common judgment. Justice Nariman writes a separate but concurring judgment. Justice Chandrachur writes a separate but concurring judgment. Justice Hindu Malhotra writes a separate but differing judgment. Her view therefore becomes a minority view. And that is therefore by majority Sabrimala is decided in a particular way. What does Sabrimala say? A large part of the common judgments, that is the Chief Justice Kandilkar, Nariman, Chandrachur, they deal with what is the distinction between an essential and an inessential religious practice. They deal with the test to constitute an essential religious practice and the proof of it. Very important addition that they have made. Third is, they deal with the right under 25 as balanced against the right of the society at large. This is the balance that they bring about in their judgment. Ani Thodkya Made, Chief Justice and Justice Hanwilkar, in my paper I have given the paragraphs, numbers and the judgments they have relied on. They observe that it is the duty of the court to determine whether a practice in a religion is equivalent to the doctrine of that religion. Tya dharma cha shastra ani tya dharma cha rudi parampara prachayit pratha are they equal? Zar astil tar that practice will be essential. But nasti that you can't make the practice essential merely because it is a part of that religion. This is one thing that they say. Second thing, zari practice ka dharma ka madhe asli reflected, tari nekil di ka dharma madhe essential ahe ka. Pahila tar dharma madhe ahe ka nahi, and dusra asel tar di essential ahe ka. Are you following the distinction between both? Kup katin nahi, all of your lawyers, so I assume your mind is making the jump. First I have to prove that the practice is a part of the religion. If I prove that, it doesn't finish. Is it a practice essential to that religion? Either by a cardinal or religion martoka. That's the test. So that is the second thing. The third thing they ask you to prove is, without that practice, would the religion be altered? Religion badlelka. And yacha uttaragur, they decide, whether a, a practice is essential or inessential. Dusra, in the absence of scriptural or textual evidence, court cannot afford the practice the status of an essential religion. Mountain Khali Uttarla Ten Commandments. How that Ten Commandments can be Dagadavar Korlele and Utlatari religious texts were a proof that way. Then the Loki was a Paglia and the Sodom Dinas. He had to show God gave it to him, so he brought it. I am not contesting whether Christian religion is right or wrong. I am saying the support of textual reference, the basis that this is proved by this text, has to be shown. Proof Kade Zayan Naglai. Andhra Shraddha nahi, tumsa belief nahi, 
साक्षी पुराव्याची सिद्ध करा म्हणतोय कोर्ट बहुत साल से हमारी औरत को गंदर नाही होऊ शकते सिद्ध करा तुमच्या धर्माचा भाग आहे बायका नात येत आहे नाही आमचा धर्म आमचा देव ब्रह्मचार्य आहे सिद्ध करा ब्रह्मचार्य समथिंग बिकम इम्पॉसिबल दॅट्स वेर इट वर्क्स दॅट्स वेर द फाईट बिगेन्स तुम होते का मग हम तू प्रूव्ह करते बोलले आम्हाला रिलिजन आहे असं कोर्ट म्हणतो ते सगळं रिव्हिजन ना ठीक आहे कोर्टात मॅटर आलं तर आम्ही कायद्याप्रमाणे चालणार आम्हाला हे सिद्ध करून लागतं दिस इज अ पार्ट विच ट्रबल्स मल्होत्रा व्हेरी मच शीज अज नो इफ पीपल बिलीव्ह इट इट मस्ट बी इन द रेक थोडक्यात मल्होत्रा इज गोईंग बॅक ऑलमोस्ट टू द पोस्ट शिरूर मागचे पहिले दुसरे तिसरे जजमेंट लोकांचा काय विश्वास आहे याच्यामध्ये तो थिंक ऑफ द स्विंग in the same court in the year 2018 you have two ends of the spectrum that are displayed so the pendulum is swinging still i have always said and i repeat it sabri mala will not be the last word it will have to be followed by great many clarifications that are to come what else do they say in, in their majority practice which emerge or change with the flux of time cannot be regarded as core religion hindu lagna dhal kay dhal ne ja brahmana ni basade avazat mangal ashtak mhanle that's not hindu religion that's not the end of the thing ne ne amcha dhore mula dhali uncha uchlun dhal but that's the thing to do with hinduism what is it which is a practice and which is not something which is integral to religion is that which can come over into your religion due to change shuruvati la namto ata ahe asha goshti nishchit dharmat nahi kal paryanta namta aspa sundar kai suru jala ase that should not be considered a part of religion i can hold for from this for another 15 minutes but it hurts religious sentiment very deeply i can go into now <laughs> I, i won't touch on that but the fact is i did argue it in the court say to me kut paryanta janar ki prithvi cha bhu garbatu ek invisible tar ya aage paryanta yete of course i now personally consider the worst villain that parsi river encounter they were chased out of persia and katanantar ani खूप छळ मांडलेला आहे त्यांनी आमचा रिलिजन उद्ध्वस्त केला आहे विथ करंट फिलिंग द इमिजिएट रिझल्ट साहेब इज माय ब्रीफ सर गॉन ड्रॅस्टिकली डाऊन देर आर मेनी सोलिसिटर्स वर आय सर्टनली नॉट सोलिसिटिंग मोर ब्रीफ फ्रॉम औरंगाबाद बट इफ दे कम आय विल बी आय गो फॉर द दिस वॉज वॉट द चीफ जस्टिस एन खानविलकर सेट नरिमन अग्रीज he says you must distinguish between a secular activity and a religious activity kiti sundar hai baka secular activity manje non dharmic action yala dharun naka dharma mane dharmic action la dharma agadi cha tanel kaat nahi secular activity ye dharmik kare don't confuse secularism with religion this is a old thing i did not take you into history but the church of england was created because the pope who was the religious head of the christian religion dominated the law and insisted that ecclesiastical law was the basis and secular law was secondary manun england cha raja ni mi swatha ka law kadto ani swatha ka church ko basa secularism and ecclesiastical religion fight as all the khap panchayats all the cow vigilantes lahan mulanna ghun kutla tari manus jate tar nakki poranna palavto yacha varun tyala dharu thoda anki lynch kara all these are the confusion between ecclesiastical and secular activities the main is that they nariman said something even more important superstitious belief which is extraneous or unnecessary accretion to religion are not essential dharmanda pana yala tumi dharma manu naka dharmandatve ni tumi kay kay dharma kandavse that is not religion 
where a religious community differs on essential aspects, court has to decide. Nariman says, no, if a religious community differs, it is the duty of the court to decide where, which, which is a religious practice and which is not. And while deciding, it has to do so on the basis of the evidence before the court, including what the community says. The community is a vaktiri paratandit. So, Chief Justice the buyer kevna Nariman thinks that, no, you can give the community a say. This aspect is enlarged by Chandrasekhar. A erudite judgment, a brilliant judgment, but he feels that community cha practices na to be saran sol dharma bayar cha hai tasa nahi maan So to some extent, Nariman, and to a somewhat larger extent, Chandrachu move closer to Hindu Malhotra than to the Chief Justice. Ekas judgment, majority eki kade gele li hai. But Jeva to me actually judgment vatsta, to mala drift to this to. And in Chandrachu, but to his other Pula Kadikari exam in Karawa, I'm not Mustay Hotel. Which is why I'm saying they are only just a TMA by one, two, three, rather than the other. Up to any cases, I think Aurutia Mudun Data. The sir, this is a something for the one, two yenar, three yenar, four yenar, and we will have to have a larger debate on this. Hindu Manotra, of course. Uh, is very clear. He says, if everybody believes that something is their religion, the courts don't have a rule. The court must accept that. But this has been, uh, this goes against so many principles. The essential idea, nine, the kind of the religions again, ka nine. is it integral or is it not integral? Is there proof? And if you don't believe that, you can say, 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 you can of a sector la vichana like a root. What is the basis for determining everybody believes this? Mahi pratha hai, ka rudhi hai, ka anna shraddha hai, yala ka importance of denar nahi ka. All these things, Hindu Malhotra is firmly of the view ki nahi tumala janamata cha kaul is what seems to her to be more important than uh, the other tests that Supreme Court has laid down. In one way, she takes the law back to Shirur Mat, which to my mind is a very dangerous and retrograde step. Thankfully, she is in minority. And because she is in minority, what she says is not the law. I have, uh, the paper of course is far more exhaustive, but I have tried to give you in very brief what it all is about. I thank you very much for having extended me this invitation and having uh, been such Wonderful audience, listen to me with a great deal of attention. I don't deserve such affection. Uh, I use these occasions more to voice my personal views than to expound the law, as you must have realized. But uh, you must excuse an old man for these indulgences. Thank you very much.